There's 14,000 race horses in the, across the country, around about 6,000 staff that all sacrifice their family time for Christmas. Because it is another day, horses don't do Christmas. You know, you can't just shut the door and say, we'll see you in a week. On Christmas Day, I come into work around about half six. I then muck out. I ride out one, two, maybe three lots, depending on how the day's running. I get my racing gear ready for the next day. It's a life, it's not a job. And everybody is a big family. You go racing, you stay in the yard, in the village, everybody knows who everybody is and that's what makes racing nice. And for Boxing Day there could be four or five meetings, we could have six, seven runners so it's spreading all the equipment and being prepared and making sure the right equipment goes to the right meetings and the lads are in on time and, and that sort of thing. You know it's, it's, a, it's a huge commitment. Christmas is probably the busiest of the year. My job when I go racing is making sure that the horses are in great order for, for the race, for their owners, everything has been done within my power to make sure that they get there in one piece. So after they've run, most important, they all come back, they're safe, they're sound, and, and, and to make sure that they're comfortable and they're happy. And they come back to us, you know, they're like our family, so they, they are really important. Dedication, end of story. They've got to be dedicated to do with horses, working with horses or animals, you've got to be dedicated. Everybody comes in on Christmas Day, they know exactly where they stand, we get the whole lot out very quickly. Plenty of jokes, it's just a question of light-heartedness and being professional at the same time.